Mankato Loyola's Fitzgerald Gymnasium will roll out, roll out the mats for the first time since 2007. That's right, there will be wrestling inside the gym when the St. Clair Loyola Grapplers host Blue Earth Area and Wabasso for a triangular starting tomorrow morning. We caught up with some of those involved in making the tournament happen. There's been plenty of thrilling basketball matchups played inside Fitzgerald campus, but now the court will transform into a stage for wrestling for the first time in more than 15 years. The St. Clair Loyola Co-op sees plenty of success on the football side with solid numbers thanks to the partnership. And now there's a push to see more numbers from Loyola when it comes to wrestling. Hosting a triangular this weekend is just part of the plan to inject some excitement between the two communities for the sport. I'm excited to just kind of incorporate both schools, both communities. I'm um, just getting more involved. Uh, right now, the last couple of years I've been there, it's just been majority St. Clair. Um, now just starting to add our numbers to the Loyola side to, to the program. And that's what I'm excited about. Um, just getting some of our athletes, you know, their friends, family members show up, just kind of have them experience what wrestling really is to some of the Loyola, you know, Loyola community. Um, and that's what I'm really excited about, just to kind of expand the program on, on their side or that side of the the co-op. Historically speaking, there's a number of great wrestlers that come out of both St. Clair and Loyola. Two grapplers to keep an eye on this year include senior Jacob Schemick and Eli Cruz. Schemick is the top ranked 215 pounder in Class A while Cruz is ranked third at 145. We gotta pay a lot to uh, uh, our coaches. They develop us really nicely um, and just work ethic wise. Um, we we want to be the best. We want to be the best in, uh, in shape. We want to be the best on the mat in the weight room. Uh, just goals. We set our goals at the beginning of the season. We say how we're going to get there, and uh, that's the biggest part. I really want to get on the podium this year. I made it to the state tournament when I was in eighth grade, and then ninth grade that COVID year, and I never met got to the placing rounds, and that's my big, big goal is to get on the podium this year. The program sent athletes to prominent colleges. For instance, Simon Cruz is a freshman at Wisconsin to continue his academic and wrestling career. The hope is that trend continues as more athletes go out for the St. Clair Loyola Co-op. Crusaders Activities Director Sam Carlson also doubles as a boys basketball head coach, but wouldn't mind seeing more athletes from his school choose wrestling. I love wrestling. I grew up around wrestling. Uh, I think it's the toughest sport out there. Um, hey, if you, if I lose a couple basketball guys and we get more guys help for wrestling, it is what it is. Uh, I'd like to see all of our uh, activities and programs flourish. And uh, I'd love to see a full wrestling team with a bunch of Loyola and St. Clair kids at some point. All the action begins at 10 tomorrow morning from the Fitz. Haley McCormick will take a look at some of those highlights during KEYC News Now at 10.